I was getting ready to put some laps on this new Point .3 Techno buggy this weekend and wanted to do a quick video. Hobbywing has recently released this XR8 Plus and I picked this one up from falconsakaido.com. This ESC will be replacing the 150 amp and besides a great new look is also rated to work with 2S now, has a selectable BEC voltage and can now be programmed from the external fan port. I wanted to show you guys what options we have now with this new ESC. First, your running mode. Same as before, select forward brake or forward reverse brake. Two, number of cells. It's rated for 2 to 6S and gives you the option of an auto calculation, but selecting your actual cell count is best. Three, your voltage cutoff. Disable, auto, or a custom voltage from 5 to 20 volts are your options here. ESC thermal protection. Here you have two temp choices or the ability to disable this feature. Five, motor thermal protection. Again, you have two temps and a disable. If you're using a non-hobbying motor, you're gonna to wanna to disable this feature. Six, motor rotation. Counterclockwise or clockwise. Seven is your BEC voltage selection, either six or 7.2 volts. Brake force, you have nine options, including disabled. Nine, your reverse force, either 25 or 50%. 10 is your punch or start mode. Uh, you're gonna have nine settings here. 11 is gonna be your drag brake, which can be set from zero to 100%. 12 is new. Coast can be used to remove that drag feel created by these larger motors. Uh, this is adjustable from 0 to 20%. 13 is your neutral range. It's still 6, 9, or 12%. Now 14 is skipped. It is listed as the drive mode, but it seems auto-detected when you hook up your motor, uh, whether you're running centerless or censored. 15 is your boost timing. Um, it gives you the options for 0 to 15 degrees. Now at this point, the instructions say that you also have the options for turbo timing and turbo delay. Now mine doesn't show this and I have a feeling that the new motors that are supposed to be coming out gives you this new option. So keep an eye out for the new motors. I'm definitely going to try one out when they come out. So that's it. If you have any questions, feel free to hit me up here or on Facebook. Thanks for watching.